What's up guys, it's Skittle Mania here, back with another video. Today's video guys, I'm going to be showing you guys my pot vinyl collection. Now guys, I have a wide variety of pot vinyls, and today guys, I thought, why not show you guys them. So guys, before I start, make sure to go like and subscribe, and tap on notifications so you know exactly when I upload. And also guys, go watch my previous video, which was going through uh, the life of Jerome Velasky from Gotham, and my first video, which was going through... Fortnite season 4. So yeah guys, my pop panels are up there. So guys, let's get them down and I'll show you all of them. So guys, this one I have out there. This is my first pop panel. Um, this is the Joker from the Dark Knight Trilogy. Um, it's not from the Dark Knight Trilogy. Um, so as you can tell, it's signed. It's signed by someone called Martin Ballantyne, who was a henchman in uh, The Dark Knight when Joker was in the prison. And um, yeah, I met him at a Comic Con and I got a huge autograph from him up there. And um, yeah, it was really nice, and I got a picture of him which I shall put on the screen right now. So, yeah, guys, this is my first one. Um, you know, it's pretty good. Um, there's the back of it, it's front. So, yeah, guys, this was kind of what started my collection. Um, so, yeah, let's move to the second one. Now, guys, this is my second pop panel. This I got at the same event um, just after I got that one, and uh, this is the Joker from the Batman 1966 TV series. And um, as you can tell, um, you know, quite good detail, instead of the purple, it's kind of pink. Um, but yeah, it is a very good pop. Uh, there's um, the rest of the card you can get on the back. Guys, if you do want any of these, um, go on Amazon or wherever. I don't recommend Amazon just because of the shipping. Uh, but there are pop stores that I do highly recommend you go and get them on. So yeah, guys, you know, um, you can tell the moustache, you might be able to see. But on the top there, you can see his moustache marks. So yeah, I'm moving to my third pop. So guys, this is my third pop vinyl, and this is another one from the Batman 966 program. Sadly, it's not from the same collection. This is from the second line, um, but we still have the characters. Um, so this is the red low, of course, as you can see. Um, this I got in town with one of my friends. Um, and yeah, um, pretty good pop, you know. I think the question mark in the centre is a bit out of place, but except from that, it's a good pop, guys. Um, this is one that I've kind of um, liked to keep basic, but I've kept for a while. So let's go on to the fourth one. So guys, this is my fourth pop vinyl. This is the Batman from the 1966 series. Um, sadly, there's a bit of a uh, tag mark on there, but except from that, it's a really good pop, guys. The paint is very good, I think. Um, so as you can see, um, it's kind of this is probably one of my best Batmans. Um, so yeah, very articulated. And um, there's the others on the back. As you can see, we've got people like Batman, we've got the Joker, we've got Harley Quinn, we've got Robin, Batgirl, and Poison Ivy. Guys, there is a second line of this. I've got one of those I'll show you in a bit. But yeah, guys, this is the fourth one, um, which I also got in town. The guys, these are a lot in town. Um, I get these from a shop called Toy Master, um, which is where pretty much all of them are from. Um, so yeah, got to move on to the fifth one. So guys, here are my fifth and sixth pop liners. These have a bit of a backstory. I got these two together. Um, oh, I didn't. My one got them, me. Um, guys, packaging's quite good. Um, it's a bit bad, just the way it came. But yeah, guys, um, these are in sale, and I got these two. Um, so we have Batman and Superman. Um, they're not based on anything, just like the DC versions. Um, so yeah, guys, uh, there's a Batman one there, or what you can collect. And then there's a Superman one, but there's a lot more we can, can collect on there. I don't know why they changed them. So yeah, guys, let's move on to my seventh. Alright guys, so I here I have my 7th, 8th and 9th pop. These I got in the same week as my Batman and Superman one. Um, I got those on the Monday, this I got these on the Saturday. Um, guys, two of these are from the Toy Master. One of these actually, guys, is actually just from Asda, to be honest with you, you know. Just found it and, um, so yeah. This one is, uh, Taze, this is my first Marvel bobblehead. And this is Taze Face from Guys of the Galaxy 2. Um, now I really want to get more of these because they are quite cool. Uh, sadly Yondu's not on there, which I'm quite upset about. Um, but the fact that Nebula's on there, and Ego, but he's not, which is annoying. And guys, that was on sale, um, and also, I got this Catwoman one, which is from the animated Batman series, so there's the second line. Um, so yeah, if you didn't know guys, the women ones tend to come with a stand, just because they struggle to stand up. And then guys, this is my one from Asda, and this is my Aquaman one, uh, from the Justice League specifically. Um, and yeah, it's very nice. Um, very neat packaging, not to keep them in shape, um, and that's the back. So yeah guys, let's move on to my next one. So guys, here we have my next one. This I got at a comic convention, and this is a Black Panther one. Um, Black Panther. And um, yeah, it's very nice. Um, this one I just kind of found because I like the looks of it. 
Um, so actually, there is inside. Um, and there, of course, you can collect. I really want to get the Killmonger suit. Um, sadly, they didn't do the black, or I haven't seen the full Black Panther suit in the Black Panther line, but I think they do have them from Civil War. But guys, the Killmonger one, where you can see it on up there, looks really cool. Um, so guys, got at something called MCon with, um, the same person that I usually get my pots with. Um, so yeah, guys, um, let's move to my next one. So guys, here we have the next one. Um, this is once again from Asda, but this is a, another bobblehead, and this is Hella from Thor Ragnarok. Um, so you know, I thought this was a really good villain, great acting. This was one of the best films. Um, in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, I think. So, guys, the headdress is very articulated, um, and I really like this pop. Um, I'm glad I got it. I want to get a really good price, so yeah, I'll just move on to my next one. Right, guys, so this is my 12th pop vinyl, and this is once again uh, from the Batman 1966 series. This is King Tut, not one of the most common like known villains, but you know, he's a good villain. This is unlike the red, like the Riddler from the second line. Um, as you can see him there, and of course King Tut's there. Um, home to get Batgirl, and Batman and Robin soon. Um, and maybe Catwoman, just to add kind of that effect to it. Guys, I do know where the Penguin is, so I probably will get him. Um, sadly, I don't know where Mr. Freeze, I might know where Batgirl is. Um, but I don't know where Catwoman, Batman or Robin are, guys, so I might have to get them off eBay or Amazon. So yeah, guys, King Tut, um, this is actually quite heavy, this is one of my heaviest ones. Um, once again, guys, got a bit of a price mark on it there, but you know what, who cares, so uh, let's have a look at my next one. So guys, here we have my 13th pot vinyl, and this is from Avengers Infinity War, this is Thanos. Um, guys, this is my biggest pot vinyl I have, and the heaviest pot vinyl I have. I'm just going to open it now for you guys. Um, I do open them, and I know how to seal them. But guys, this is a very large one, and it's actually quite heavy. In fact, guys, I what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my other... Uh, another bubble head out, and I'm going to compare this to one of the other bubble heads. So, guys, here I have my Hella Pop vinyl, and here we have the Thanos Pop. As you can see, the Thanos one is a lot bigger, guys. Um, you know, maybe twice the size. Once again, both bubble heads. But, guys, I forgot to show you this, this is Hella's headdress, very articulated. I do like it. But, yeah, guys, Thanos's head. Look at the bold, look at the light shine of that, the boldness. But, yeah, guys, the the size is, I was going to say, if I just even put this on the table, guys, this sticks up. But yeah, guys, I can just put those there. Um, you can tell the size difference. So yeah, guys, this one um, is one of my only Infinity War line pops. Um, as you can see, um, there's the line. Um, I think there's another line because I've seen a Black Widow one, which is not on here. So yeah, guys, um, let's have a look at my 14th. Okay, guys, so these next four are from my birthday. Um, which is surprisingly because um, this is my 14th pop and I am now 14. So yeah guys, this is the Green Power Ranger from the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers original series. Um, you know, it's it's nice. It's sadly not got all of the rings on the back. It's got the green, black, blue and yellow. But you know guys, it is very good. Um, if you didn't know, Tommy is my favourite ranger. I love the Green Ranger. Um, there is a, another ranger that I prefer, but I just really wanted this one because I love the... Um, kind of shoulder pieces. So yeah, guys, this is the Green Power Ranger, and um, this is one of my four pots I got for my birthday. I just want to shout out to everyone who got me for my birthday. So Harry got me this one. Um, Ellie has got me some up there. I'll show you guys who got them all. But yeah, guys, so this is the one Harry got me, and this is the Green Power Ranger. So let's move on to the next 15 form. So guys, this one is the joke from Suicide Squad. This is one that my friend Ellie got me for my birthday as well, which is nice. Um, so yeah, guys, um, it's the topless joker with the purple glove on there. I think you can see it. Uh, but around there's purple glove. So yeah, guys, um, this is the early Suicide Squad one I've got. I really would love to get all of the jokers and maybe some deadshot ones. But yeah, guys, so this is my 15th. And this is, as I said, what Ellie got me. Um, so yeah guys, um, Pop Heroes one, even a joke is a villain. Um, so yeah guys, move on to my next Pop Vinyl. Alright guys, so this is the third out of fourth one I got for my birthday. And this is the White Power Ranger from the Mighty Morphin Power Ranger series. And this is from someone called Zachary. Now guys, Zachary is probably one of my best friends. Um, he's got, I've been in town with him. Um, I got a bunch of pots from him. I got with him, I got the Riddler, I got Batman. I got Taser Face, Catwoman, Aquaman, Black Panther, 
um, Thanos, and yeah, guys, those are all I've got from Cyrus Cannon. Um, so I have been in town loads with him. I've been to two comic events, um, one with him, but one with someone else. So yeah, guys, um, this has got the rest of the Rangers on. Um, sorry if they look a bit squished. This because they were in my bag, holiday school day. But if you think this is squished, wait till the next one. Um, so yeah, guys, this is. Um, you see on this one, unlike the film series, they're in like poses and they're not just standing there like blocks. So yeah, guys, um, this is my favourite ranger ever. So yeah, I'll move on to the final two. Right, guys, this is my second to last one. This is the last one I got for my birthday. And guys, this is the Executioner. Um, first of all, Executioner from Stars of Last Jedi. Guys, this packaging is the worst packaging I've actually ever had. This is from my friend Zach. Um... I had it in my school bag for a long, long time, and yeah, guys, it's very bad. Um, I really might have to set it that up, which I don't really want to do because I like to open them sometimes and display them. So yeah, guys, um, I really like this one. But I actually brought one for him, and he knew how much I wanted one, so he got me one, which was nice. So yeah, guys, this is a uh, tenth last one, which was the last one I got for my birthday. This is from Zach, as I might have said. And yeah, guys, let's move on to my last one. All right, guys, this is my last pop for today. Um, and this is one I got today. And this is from Batman Dark Knight Rises. Oh, no, it returns. And this is Carrie Kelly Robin. Um, this is from Dark Knight Returns. Um, basically, go Robin. That is the back. So here we have Batman. We have um, Armoured Batman, which I'm assuming is like... Um, the kind of Bat vs Superman. Uh, we have Batman on Mash, we have Superman, the Robin, and then we have the Joker. Guys, if you didn't know about this, this is basically um, about Batman when he's quite old. As you can tell by the old face on there. So, yeah, guys, got this today. A very good pop. So, yeah, guys, that is sadly about it. Right, guys, so that's about it for today. Um, I'll show you all my pops in a minute at the end of the video. But guys, um, I'm glad I hope you enjoyed this video. I will do a updated pop vinyl collection, guys. Um, I decided to upload this because I'll show you in a minute. But I have completed my second layer. I've got two layers, so one is on top of the other. So, yeah, guys, I'll show you all of my pops. I'm very organised. They're all in the old one. I got them. Um, so, yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Right guys, that's it from me, um, so I will see you in the next video. Uh, next video, I was planning to do the Fortnite one. Guys, I think I'm going to do a Fortnite dance in public video with a bunch of friends. Hopefully we're going to get um, some of the friends I mentioned in this video today. We might get Harry and Zachary. Um, maybe we even get someone called Will. I know he'll be watching this, so you know. Um, I'll get to do some dancing in public in Fortnite. And yeah guys, um, I'll see you in the next video. So, goodbye.